वेलकम टू द डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ मास कम्युनिकेशन कलगोटियाज यूनिवर्सिटी आई एम डॉक्टर निक्की तिवारी योर कोर्स कोऑर्डिनेटर ऑफ मीडिया इंडस्ट्री एंड एंटरप्रेन्योरशिप बी एच एस सी थ्री डबल जीरो टू टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द रेवेन्यू मॉडल ऑफ रेडियो प्री रिक्वेसाइट ऑफ दिस कोर्स इज बेसिक्स ऑफ रेडियो ब्रॉडकास्टिंग एंड को रिक्वेसाइट ऑफ दिस कोर्स इज कंप्यूटर विद इंटरनेट कनेक्शन learning objectives on completion of this topic the students will be able to explain the revenue model of a radio station a frequently asked question is how the radio stations generate revenue radio stations do not charge their listeners for the content they create and distribute instead they make a profit from the ads they sell the special events they hold the syndication of their most popular shows and in some cases the special services they can provide to other radio stations now i'm going to discuss how the radio stations generate revenue through ad sales advertising makes up a major part of radio station revenue both on air as well as via station websites social media profiles and streaming services For example, stations sell airtime to companies that wish to reach the audience with messages about their products or services. The spots vary in price depending on their length, the time of the day they run and the show during which they air. In some cases, advertisements are read by on-air personalities in hopes that more people will pay attention when their favorite host is the one speaking. These spots tend to cost more than the traditional commercial. Besides traditional ad sales, radio station managers have looked to other revenue models such as selling graphic ads on the radio website or to participate in advertising networks and affiliate programs. Radio stations that receive distribution via social media sites such as youtube or streaming services may participate in revenue generation programs that allow the service to run ads before or during the streamed programming revenue generation from radio special events radio stations often hold special events sometimes on their own and sometimes in concert with advertising partners These sponsored events serve the dual purpose of attracting new listeners to the station and bringing in extra revenue through ticket sales and merchandising. Next is syndication of popular programs. Radio stations are always on the lookout for the next big on-air personality. Radio stations are able to sell the rights to air one of their shows to other stations in exchange for big money. Other stations are eager to fill their air time with well-known popular shows and often will bid against one another for the privilege to do so. The bigger the show and the more markets it reaches, the more the host and her contracted station stand to make. Selling newscast to other radio stations. Radio stations with a news focus sometimes sell hourly feeds and direct news wire product to other stations around the country. The idea is to eliminate the need for every station to manage its own staff of reporters and news anchors to create an hourly broadcast and breaking news updates. For example, NBC News Radio offers a national radio service that features NBC reporters delivering individual news stories, piecemeal and hourly newscast available through integrated services digital network that is ISTN. Each station can decide to purchase the feed and run the news as its own during the appropriate time slots. These news services are offered by several different stations and bring in a good deal of revenue. Revenue generation through selling sponsorships. Sometimes the best way to get a new advertising client on board is to meet her halfway with a sponsorship program. Sponsorships combine the good name of the station or show with the good name of the product being sold to create a joint venture that promotes all involved. the cost are sometimes 
shared by the two parties and the initial results are a good way to demonstrate what can be accomplished with further advertising commitments now i'm going to discuss about the revenue model of a new media the most common sources of revenue are following ad based revenue model websites generate revenue by displaying ads on their website websites directly sell their ad space directly to companies and thus companies ensure the positioning of their products on the home page of the website google adsense is also being used by websites to display the relevant ads pertaining to users Google AdSense provides a way for publishers to earn money from their online content. AdSense works by matching ads to your site based on your content and visitors. The ads are created and paid for by advertisers who want to promote their products. Pay per click revenue model. The another way to generate revenue is using a pay per click model. This is where you receive commission from the advertisers every time someone clicks through to their advert from your web page. Advertisers are charged not simply for the number of times their ads are displayed, but according to the number of times they are clicked. These are typically text ads similar to sponsored links but delivered over the third party sites. Affiliate revenue model Another popular web-based revenue model is the affiliate revenue model which works by promoting links to relevant products and collecting commission on the sales of those products. Next one is subscription revenue model. Many of the websites have adopted this model to generate revenue. The subscription revenue model entails offering your customers a product or service that customers can pay for over a longer period of time, usually on monthly basis or yearly basis. Publishers often use a premium revenue model where subscribers gain free access to a limited number of sample articles. The premium model is one in which a company's basic services are free. Yet users must pay for additional premium features, extensions, functions, etc. In this model, limited free access is provided, but the fee is charged for the full service. For example, visit the website of the newspaper, The Hindu. You can read few of the news stories freely on the website, while for reading other stories, they appear to take subscription to read the full story. Revenue generation through donations or crowd fundraising. Many of the news websites are requesting their audience to donate money with an appeal that if you want the unbiased news, then help the website. The websites are requesting to get money from people in the form of a help so that they can work independently. Sponsorship revenue model. Websites generate revenue through the sponsorship of contents. Sponsored content is a type of promo promotional media that's paid for by an advertiser, but created and shared by another brand, influencer or publisher. This type of content is most engaging when you sponsor a company or influencer who targets your core audience. These are the references from where the contents have been taken. Thank you.